How's it going everybody? Okay, so in this video I'm going to show you how we're going to measure and track your progress um, with a couple of different metrics. Okay, the first one is going to be um, scale weight. So I'm going to get you to use the scales um, as a measure obviously of your, of your scale weight. Um, so before we start um, the program, I'm going to get you to do that. So just whatever scales you have at home, just step on it. Um, whatever it gives you, it gives you. You can send me on um, the whatever your weight is through WhatsApp or a private message on Facebook or whatever way you want to do it, okay? Um, so it's just a, a measure of where you are now and then we'll, we'll do it again um, in a month. Um, scale weight only tells you a small part of the story. Uh, I don't like people to get too bogged down or to focus on that um, too much, okay? So scale weight, track that, um, just step on the scales and send me on whatever weight it gives you, okay? Nextly then, I would like everybody to get two tape measures, okay? So the first one being, obviously, um, you, you can take off your top and do it like on tape against skin, okay? I'll just demonstrate here. So a good measure of where to go. So we're gonna, we're gonna go waist and then we're gonna go hip and they're just the two measures that I want you to take, okay? So a good guide is in around your belly button and um, you can obviously do that yourself. It might be helpful to get somebody to help you. You get a little bit of a truer reflection. Um, and we'll try and get this in centimeters if we can. Okay, so you're trying to get Put it in, not overly tight, but nice, nice comfortable tightness, um, and just measure where you are on that, okay? So it can be around your belly button or the widest part of your stomach um, or the biggest circumference. So take it there, and then we're gonna, when we retest that, you're gonna use the exact same place, okay? If you don't have it, um, a tape measure, you should use a piece of string um, or anything around there and measure, take the size of it and then use a measuring tape and then just measure out the piece of string that was the, the circumference of your um, waist. Okay, so you don't need to have one of these, um, so just use the string if you don't. Um, the next measure then will be around your hips. Okay, so basically you're gonna take the widest part of your backside and measure around there. Okay, so for this one as well, you can do it yourself. And um, just make sure that you're getting the widest part. Okay, and again, just take the measure there. It might help to get somebody um, to do it for you either, okay? So we're gonna take two measures, waist and hip, um, and just try and get those done in centimeters, and then same thing, you can send them on to me in WhatsApp um, or in a private message. So what's, what this is gonna do is you reduce um, body fat, and as you get a little bit leaner, hopefully, these measurements will come down, okay? So another measure that for you to think about, um, you don't have to give this back to me, but just how you're feeling in your clothes. Um, so if your clothes as the program is going on are feeling a little bit looser, um, that's obviously a good measure of your, your progress and body composition as well, okay? Then the last way of doing it, and this is entirely up to you, you don't have to send it to me at all, keep them for yourself, um, it's gonna be progress photos. Okay, so you can take a photo of yourself facing front on. Obviously, try and have the minimum amount of clothing um, on so you can see like a real true reflection of yourself at the moment. So front on, side on, and then facing away. Okay, so three pictures. Um, save them on your phone or keep them for yourself. And then at the end of the pro, at the end of like four weeks or at the end of the program, we'll have a look at those again, okay? Because you see yourself every day in the mirror, you're not gonna notice those little changes, but um, it might take it might take four weeks, it might take um, eight weeks, but you will see some changes if you're sticking to your training program and your nutrition, okay? So just to recap, so we're gonna take, um, or we have four ways that you're gonna measure your improvement and body composition. So it's gonna be scale weight, it's gonna be tape measure around waist and hip, it's going to be um, how your clothes are feeling um, or how your clothes are fitting you. And then the fourth one is going to be progress um, photos. Fifth one obviously will be how you're feeling yourself. If you have more energy, if you're, if you're feeling good, if you're feeling positive, if you're feeling happy, if you're feeling stronger, um, that's also another measure of that, okay? But just for your feedback to me and for tracking, um, we're gonna go with those four measures.